anyone who has ever gone near a hog farm will tell you the smell is terrible. It comes from hog manure, which is stored in underground pits. When spring comes, the hog manure will be sprayed on farmland as fertilizer without any processing treatment. Now the hog farm in northeast China's Liaoning province is taking a different approach. We are making good use of waste. The feces runs through this drainage ditch, and we then collect it and use it as organic fertilizer, which significantly contributes to the fertility of the soil. Livestock waste is a major source of noxious gases and harmful pathogens. Over the years, the country's policymakers have vowed to increase crop yield and sustainability by turning animal waste into biogas and organic fertilizers, which is a good way for the farmers to generate more income. China's livestock produce about 3.8 billion tons of manure each year, more or less the amount of coal consumed nationwide. But nearly 40 percent of this waste stays untreated and poses a long-lasting challenge to the environment. Wang Dongning raises chickens, and he has recently invested in a livestock waste collecting system. He believes it is money well spent. The system is costly, but if the waste can be treated immediately, the chance that the chicken gets sick is lower, so in the long run, our profit margins go up. During this year's Central Rural Work Conference, officials will discuss issues like modernization and the competitiveness of farm products. For ordinary people, food safety is one of the top concerns. The concern now is making sure more of the country's farm waste is treated properly, which will lead to safer food. Livestock farms have to reach a certain size in order to make the utilization of waste feasible. Problems exist in those smaller farms that don't have the funds to realize the method, or the amount of waste is not worth spending the money on. Livestock waste can be recycled by many modern ways. But for the world's most populous nation, tackling pollution in rural areas, especially pollution from agricultural sources, will be a top priority in the coming years. Guanyang, CGTM, Liaoning Province.